Dominic, I'm going to go ahead and let you go first. What have you been up to gaming wise? Uh, um, I mean, over on my channel, if you want to check it out, me and my friend Gian, we're, we've been playing Super Mario World. Um, mm. The first couple of episodes came out uh, this week, and then this will be a second set of episodes coming out next week. Um, I'm no good at Mario. I thought I was growing up. It turns out I wasn't, but I've gotten better. <laughs> you know, if, if it's like any game that can get like an audible response for me whenever I'm about to die, it, it's not a Souls game. It's not Doom. It's not well, insert whatever generic hard game here. It is fucking Mario. Like if I miss a jump, I'm like, God damn, what the f-? It, it's always <laughs> Mario. It is always platformers like that. <laughs> if you like love watching that too, um, this was last year uh, in September. Uh, me and my friend Gian, we tried breaking the world record in Super Mario Bros. for um, co-op. Uh, mm-hmm. If you love seeing people fail and just kind of scream at the camera, I mean, I would recommend that one. Is it? Because well, it's like uh, it's one button. So if you mess up, it's you. It's on you. Like, <laughs> oh, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> one could say that Mario is the Dark Souls of platformer. No, it's, don't say that. that. That's yeah. Crash. That's but, Crash Four. No. I was ready to agree, but I don't know anything. <laughs> don't agree with me. I'm being a shit. <laughs> um, so I guess what kind of games do you generally uh, make videos on, or or what's your maybe maybe like even your thought process on that? I mean, it depends. Like, like I would text my friend because like I try to vary it with like different people on the channel. But the main is me and my friend Gian, and we've been kind of doing like Mario games just because for um, Switch, those are kind of the games we have shared um when i'm playing with like my brothers just whatever we have shared we tried doing minecraft but those videos got accidentally deleted uh, my fault um, <laughs> um uh, in two weeks um my brothers and i and uh, my best friend jessica we're gonna be doing uno and that one was a lot of fun so look out for that um i know we did um a dead by daylight stream a little a while ago i don't it was that like was fun months. but yet again i died a lot i mean once was a sacrifice and it helped you win it, it is hard to win at that game some, I mean, some you got an just like dashingly good yeah <laughs> I, I, I wasn't expecting like me trying to fix like a generator all of a sudden a freaking knife just like straight up like out of a horror movie you're working on something then a knife just whizzes past your <laughs> face and lands in the tree right next to you it's and I remember I walked down, I'm like, what's going on? And then you ran, and, and then I forget what kind of monster just, like, attacked me instead. We gotta get back to that sometime. Dead by Daylight's a, it's a good time. It is. Any uh, future plans for other videos? Um, it's kind of always up in the air. Like, it, it, de- it depends, because um, I'm trying to do a little bit more short films, but that's going to take a while. Um, podcasting wise um my podcast that i made last year where we reminisce will be coming back for season two hopefully in a month or two i'm starting to record that but um as for my let's plays those are kind of like that um like factory kind of style like okay i can play this this is fun and i can edit and it's kind of like streamlined where those videos do come out frequently and i'm also open to anybody who wants to like play and like do something fun for like a mm-hmm. short week uh, can you go into your podcast a little bit? Because I'm going to be honest. When I saw that you were posting about it and I checked out a couple of the episodes, uh, I think that's probably honestly the push that got me to go ahead and get this Aww. started. Aww. So and, and so the only reason why we're all here and the reason why I have all, all my friends here is because of you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> but um, <laughs> yeah, if you want to go ahead and uh, talk about your podcast, um, uh, what it's about and whatnot. <laughs> Uh, so my podcast Log is in. called Where We Reminisce. It's basically me going out. Okay, so wait, let me take a step back. I went to a private school going up, so it was a small class of like twenty to twenty-seven people. So after that, like everyone went their separate ways, stayed in touch with only like a few people. So my podcast, Where We Reminisce, is me going back and catching up with these people, see how they are doing in life and where they plan on going, and just catching up and creating new memories, hopefully down the line. That's a freaking beautiful premise. Yep, I love that. That's actually <laughs> really that's really uh, mm-hmm. uh, unique. It's like a high school reunion without the awkwardness. <laughs> <laughs> There's still some awkward times. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. No, but uh, <laughs> sorry. No, I was just gonna say. I'm sure. Like, I'm yeah, because I can imagine that being somewhat awkward. Because I I can imagine you don't mesh well with everyone. 
that you went to school yeah. with. So yeah, mm-hmm. for as small as a class it was, like there were still like subgroups and everything, and and like school stuff, basically kids and mm-hmm. everything. Mm-hmm. So like even reaching out, I'm like, are they even gonna like remember me or like respond or like were we close? What what happened? Mm-hmm. <laughs> so it's always a shot in the dark, like just I, throwing I, out that text. I will say it, it is. It, it does suck. I, I had a friend that I had grown I had grown up with. We we played on like kid soccer teams before like we even started kindergarten. Then we were in kindergarten together, first grade, like all all three elementary knew each other. I shot him a message like a year ago, just like, "Hey man, how's it going? I saw you you got your freaking like law degree. That's awesome." He's just like, "Who are you?" I'm just like, "Damn!" Like I remembered you my entire <laughs> life. Damn, fuck me again. <laughs> <laughs> you know because sometimes i'll like i'll send the message like on facebook and i'll see that they read it i'm like okay i see how it is <laughs> yeah it's you, i think we have to remember that it's like it's not necessarily that it's not necessarily that they decidedly chose to forget you it's oh, yeah. literally it's, just it's like just life some people some people you give an impression to and they'll remember you their whole lives and other people you're just uh, basically a blur in the background just I mean to be. I mean to be fair. Yeah. I think we all have to look inward and realize we've probably done that to millions of other people. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Hands oh, yeah. down. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I hate that feeling. Like one time I was crossing the street and someone said hi to me. Like, ooh, I'm sorry. Who? Who are you? <laughs> I, yeah. I mean, I mean t- to put it like this: if there was ever like a very attractive person in the hallway, you'd pass by. You thought the world of them, but you weren't even on their blip. Th- Dominic, you were that hot person to someone else, and you did the same <laughs> thing to them. <laughs> I hope I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh my lord! Uh, uh. <laughs> but um, if I, if I could plug something in like really quickly, yeah, good. Um, but because of like the podcast, it um it generated like kind of the spinoff of my YouTube channel and doing my let's plays because I did an episode oh, with my friend Gian. We played just Switch while we did the podcast and. Like half a year later, I text him like, "Hey, do you want to do Let's Plays?" And we've been doing that for weeks. We see each other now regularly, well, over Discord. But before it was like once a year we would say hi to each other, maybe. But now it's like every week we're like getting in touch again. Mm-hmm. That's a good. Show. And so it, it's been an amazing feeling, just like kind of catching up with these people and kind of getting back into each other's lives, even if it's just like a text saying, "Hey, how's it going?" Once a month instead of like three or four years. I think that's I, I this is, I'm going to try to phrase this in a, an appropriate way and feel free to call me out if I do it shittily. Um, obviously, COVID fucking sucks. Uh, quarantine sucks. Like this is a complete fucking disaster on like every miserable scale in the world. But I I think there are some small side effect benefits that have come from that where companies are realizing they don't necessarily need people to be in the office and it's actually more productive to have people working at home it's improving people's lives to have like these kind of revelations come in the top and even as we had as i at least mentioned earlier i'm able to keep it is incentivized keeping in touch with friends you wouldn't maybe um normally see in person um my friendship with Corey has sprouted 10 freaking to- <laughs> fold and i am a happier human being for it you mean to tell me that people are happier and more productive when they work from home what the heck what kind of <laughs> socialist country are you trying to run <laughs> jose <laughs> uh, i i don't know comrade <laughs> no, but i get you uh jose like the reason why all like this has started is because like i got let go by my job because of COVID, and it gave me so much free time to start doing stuff like my own stuff that i wanted to do and it spun off so many other things and and like um if you listen to like my season one finale i recorded with who are my best friends right now and that was a mess of things it took like eight times to actually record because i mean things went haywire like every take like it wasn't like script or anything just like as soon as i start someone would say something we're like no you can't this is a more wholesome podcast which created a spinoff which um we're working on hopefully comes out this year called for the boys which is complete randomness off like we'll say one thing in the beginning and i just let them go sweet (laughs) What is this concept of called wholesome? I don't understand that. Uh, let's 
see. <laughs> Actually, let me mark this down real quick. <laughs> I thought he was going to Google the word wholesome. Oh, no, <laughs> like, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's look at the definition, shall we? <laughs> like, <laughs> oh, geez. Look, I'm a bimbo. I'm not that much of a bimbo. <laughs> um, 